I've always been afraid of the forest. The forest is full of mystery, full of danger. My name is Bill. I hate bears. When I was a little boy, my mother would tell me stories of the forest. The forest is a scary place, she would say. The forest is full of bears. Bears like to eat horrible, bad little boys. Don't be a bad little boy, Bill, she would say. Don't be a bad boy. Mr. Johnson, I... I'm sorry. I cannot discuss business without my wife being present. When do you expect her? She is currently indisposed and will be along momentarily. Mr. Johnson, I'd like to offer you one million dollars to be the spokesman for barely their toilet paper. I'm sorry, Mr. Dean. I must decline, for I hate bears. I respect your decision as a scholar and a woodsman. Good day, Mr. Johnson. Good day, Mr. Dean. Good day, Mrs. Johnson. understand, <clears throat> okay, the mother's oppressive attitude in keeping him safe made him, uh, and her stories of the dangers made him uh, afraid of bears and how his wife capitalized on that to make him abed her psychotic actions in killing people. Okay, but, <clears throat> but who benefited from him turning down the million dollars, the million dollar deal? What did that do for her? Why does she care? Why is her controlling important? I mean... I just don't understand why this is a horror film. Horror film? I thought they said horrible film. <laughs> well, it looked like Aunt Toledo Ann's peach preserves were back in the jar and she was none the wiser. Mr. Dean was in the backyard pushing up daisies and them cup of meat boys, <laughs> well, they're at it again.